uh, the weather's just giving us terrible trouble, but you know, it's kind of welcome to the Gulf of Mexico. But typically we're here in a great time of year. We should have maybe a little bad weather here and there, but we should be dealing with, you know, ideal flat seas. But it's been anything but that. We've had to call off the expedition, go into port from some really bad weather, come back out again. And of course that costs us a lot of time and effort. It's quite a challenge, but we are tagging a few sharks in between. So we've got just a little bit of a weather window. I mean, it's not great, but at least it's fishable. So we're hoping to capitalize on that today and tomorrow while we have a little bit of decent fishing conditions. So far, we've tagged three sharks, two scalloped hammerheads and a tiger shark. And you know, every shark is important to us. So even just a few sharks matter. Of course, we've got a you know, long way to go still on what our goal was for this expedition, but just having a few sharks tagged um, that we wouldn't otherwise is gonna be key to the science. But we also look at things like artificial reefs and can we offset habitat loss by man creating artificial reefs essentially. And so we study those as it relates to uh, increasing or enhancing fish abundance. And that includes all fishes and especially sharks. So a major premise of this expedition will be overlaying those migration patterns we see from the tracker to the artificial reefs that we know about that are in the Gulf. The crew on the ship all the way up to the, the scientists gathering their scientific gear, there's a lot of work to do and so we've got this team together and so if the weather will cooperate for us for the next few days here, hopefully we can tag a few more sharks.